Welcome back to my channel. Please subscribe to my channel and press bell button. Today we are going to talk about Idina Menzel, the Broadway and Disney sensation, recently spilled the beans about her new disco album, Drama Queen, during a chat at the Grammy Museum in Los Angeles. This album with its groovy tunes is quite different from her usual ballads. She humorously mentions that she'll be belting out ballads even in her 90s and performing classics like Defying Gravity and Let It Go in random Vegas spots where nobody's hiring her. But there's more to this story. Menzel's disco journey isn't entirely unexpected. She started her singing career by covering tracks from disco queens like Donna Summer and Gloria Gaynor at Bat Mitzvahs. Those early days were like a musical playground for her where she experimented and made mistakes without anyone paying much attention. Now, Menzel is taking a different path. After years of attempting to conquer the pop charts with limited success, she's finally made an album that's true to herself. She doesn't care about what industry insiders think she should do, and she's not overthinking it. In her words, she just doesn't give a F asterisk asterisk asterisk, but hold on. Menzel realizes her audience includes young Frozen fans, She's known as Elsa from Disney's Frozen, after all. It's a bit of a challenge for her because, at 52, she's an East Coast girl who likes to enjoy a drink and find her husband attractive. It's tough being a role model when you're known as a Disney queen. Menzel acknowledges that these are what you might call champagne problems. She's incredibly grateful for what Frozen has brought into her life. It's a dream come true, connecting with young people as a mom herself. But there's a catch. Singing empowering songs for kids when you're in your 50s and struggling to get out of bed some mornings feels a bit hypocritical. However, Let It Go remains one of her proudest moments. In a nutshell, Idina Menzel's new disco album is her way of saying, I'm doing what I love, and I'm not worried about fitting into anyone else's mold. Despite the challenges of being a Disney queen and a role model, she's keeping it real and groovy, 